Hi, thanks for joining us for another episode of Money TV. I'm Don Bellage, and so glad you could be with us. We are all about money and what makes it happen. Well, this week, mobile phone giant Verizon started taking pre-orders from current Verizon customers for the Apple iPhone, easily the most desired mobile phone on the planet. Now, on February 10th, it becomes available to everyone, but the impact of the Apple iPhone is nothing short of incredible. By the end of last year, more than 73 million iPhones had been sold, and that number just continues to grow. Recently, Apple announced that its 10 billionth application or app for the iPhone had been da downloaded. 10 billion. It took McDonald's more than 20 years to sell its 10 billionth hamburger. Apple reached the 10 billion app number in less than four years. Of course, the news that Verizon now has the iPhone is very bad news for AT&T, who has basically had a monopoly on the device since 2007. Verizon is no doubt expecting to sign up millions of former AT&T subscribers, who, if they do make that switch, are going to have to purchase another iPhone, because their current AT&T version will not work on the Verizon system. Now, add that to the fact that AT&T recently doubled the cost of early contract termination, and it can cost an AT&T customer $500 or more just to switch to Verizon and buy a new iPhone, but many people will do just that. Now, even if you have no intention of joining the iPhone revolution, or perhaps you happen to be one of the three, maybe four people who don't own a mobile phone, the iPhone impacts you nonetheless. The iPhone is the product of Apple. It's a U.S.-based company, but several of its parts are manufactured in countries like Japan, Germany, South Korea, and China, to name but a few. These parts are then shipped to where the iPhone is assembled, in China. Then they're exported from China to the U.S. and the world, ultimately adding a whopping $1.9 billion to USA's burgeoning trade deficit with China. One product, the iPhone, $1.9 billion to the U.S.-China trade deficit. Now, just 15 years ago, Business Week magazine described Apple as a company in serious decline, but today, just one of their products, the iPhone, is a major player on the world economic stage. Now, if you get your iPhone handy, remember this toll-free number, 888-259-4449. That's the number to call to get free information in the mail about our featured guests. When you do call, be sure and ask to be added to the subscription list of our Money TV newsletter. Again, toll-free from anywhere in the world, 888-259-4449. On your iPhone or any mobile phone, text Money TV to GO800 or 46800. You can visit us and watch this program again at our website, MoneyTV.net. We'd love to have you follow us on Facebook and Twitter.